And we're back here at the Vans World Cup of Surfing. Second jewel of the Vans Triple Crown of Surfing. Nat Young, Gadsden Andre, Tori Meister, Mitch Cruz, all out in the water for heat number 10. We just saw Gabriel Medina win his heat, and we just saw this guy come out of a barrel. Getting used to seeing that. Tori Meister in the white jersey. Wow. Tori there, just finding a, a little cave. So let's take another look at it. Yeah, this is big. This is big for Jaddy, and you're not going to see anyone in a surf world that wears his emotions on his sleeve more than that man on your screen right there, Jadson. Uh, bottom line, though, the guy absolutely tears, and here we go. Up and riding, Nat Young. Has a spectacular backhand developed over there. Get it done, but he can also get it done at pipe. Here we go. Mitch Cruz cruising through a cutback. Working up some board speed down the line, a little bit of a flat section, looking where to go. And that wave just kind of gave up on Mitch Cruz. Meanwhile, Jadson tucks into a little bubble, hops down the line, banks off the lip. Cuddy on the corner, and he's going to stick with it. So Jadson just surfing this wave out, and Showing a bit of variety with a couple different turns and that little grab rail barrel to start off with, Ross. Ship event, uh, I believe, it was in 2010 against Kelly Slater, doing big old air reverses in Brazil. So underrated at this point, trying to get his groove back. Here's Mitch Cruz, deep water special right there. Nowhere to go, so he's going to be back on the hunt. Behind him, Jadson, tucking in, using that, that front leg. Even his rear end, just for a second to slow down. So just a quick cover-up. Um, he's not going to get too big of a score at that barrel, but it wasn't too bad. It was definitely functional. But watch as he hops around. This is kind of his MO as a surfer. You know, he doesn't really link rail to rail a lot. He kind of hops between turns. You can see that right there just to get speed. Yeah, uh, and I'm excited to, to be at Sunset. I want to really good, uh, I wanna do, do well here, you know. Uh, so, yeah. And asking you, I mean, is it... A place that it's nice to kind of come early and get acclimatized. I mean, because you end up having a lot of boards here and trying out different boards. So is it is it something you have to do to come early to get kind of in rhythm? Uh, yeah, like that he's in first place with a four six seven and a four two three, but here is a six point ride from that young. A beautiful shape on that wave. So you can see, right now the swell is dropping just a little bit, but I don't mind that. It's focused more on the point closer to the shallow bit of reef. So you're gonna see good shape, like nice barrels pulling late, and Mitch Cruz have to bail. And amongst the chaos, Jadson says, you know what, I'm gonna hook it under the lip, and I'm gonna kick out, because I saw that wave go flat. So you know where his head's at, he, he realizes his career's on the line, so he surfs with uh, an, a crazy amount of passion. You know, he has in his score line. Jadson up and riding. Nice carve off the top. And a second carve for Jaddy. Has to cut back for turn number three. Sticking with it. Looking down the line for a finish. Bangs the lip there and completes his ride. Slowly but surely finding uh, a wave that kind of allows him to tee off. Opening carve there. There's a deep spot. Another kind of deep spot section, but a better carve in here. It's going to wall up for him on his second section. So I see right here, he's eyeballing it. And it, it's going to reach some shallow water right about here and stand up. And he banks it home. So three turns. Mitch Cruz. Cruising through a bottom turn. And a nice cut back. Has to stay on rail for the second cut back. Banks against the oncoming white water to finish off the wave. So... Uh, one more look here at Mitch Cruz, grabbing that wall there. Pretty nice carve there, but uh, drawing wide angles. So you can see those cutbacks typically don't really get the, the big scores, but that closeout reentry was clean from Mitch, so over. And during the break, we saw this from Nat Young. Wow, Nat Young perfectly slotted right behind that little teepee. And that's what you call backdooring a section right there. So Nat Young, just a short barrel, but Again, we're looking into it, so you can imagine how deep he is. And uh, I didn't mind it, you know, the line he chose before he even got to his feet, Kaipo, was what made that ride uh, a decent score. 
uh, sneaky little barrel. Gets that into first place. Mitch Cruz flying down the line, lip line climb off the bottom. A little bit of a bobble, but works it out at the end there to hook a cutback. Nurses through another cutback as that wave goes into the flats, and Mitch Cruz kicks out. So we'll keep an eye on Tori, see if he can find one. But this is wide. You can see the difference on the wave is the shape. It's in that deeper water. It's tough to surf, so a lot of connecting of the dots. Just a big floater there. Uh, you know, an awkward cutback due to all those wrinkles and chops in the wave. So it's going to affect the score for this wave. Nat Young up and riding again off the bottom and vertical attack off the lip. A little cut back into the power section. Weaving his board through some of the flats. Smacks the lip one more time. He's going to bounce through another little flat section and hoping for this bank right there for the closer. Rebounds goes left. And the camera takes us outside to Tori Meister with a big snap off the top. Off the bottom again, whitewater climb. Very difficult, and that whitewater just grabs the rails. Of Someone's bound to get that eight-point rider better. Look at the shape of that wave. Beautiful barrel there, but not deciding to say, uh, I'm over the barrel, I'm going to go in front and get work done on the face. But you saw that wave a bit had that cramped almond shape, so it's really tough to hit the lip. Uh, so the opening maneuver, which would be always the most important, he kind of got handcuffed, but he did a good job at finishing this wave, even going left for a hot minute there, and a little rebound for Nat. So I think he's going to get rid of the four. Behind him, Tori Meister, local boy. Look at that wave, beautiful opening section, and that's a nice hook right before the lip came. He kind of had great timing of that, very quick little snap. Um, and then joining Nat right there on the inside, this is where that lip again kind of halted his speed. You saw he lost that momentum on that second turn. Uh, but a couple of serious moves before he fell. So I still feel like Tori, uh, he's going to have a solid score here. This maneuver right here is nice. Watch as he arcs back into the pocket, sets up for this section right here. That's where it stood up nice and tall. And he play. And even though he fell at the end, the judges loved it. Here's a replay of Jadson Andre. Absolute whopper. I agree. And so here we go. Let's see if Jadson can really connect on that rail. There is another sharp little off the lip for Jaddy and a smooth under the lip. There's the claim. Knowing that he's in third place, there's not a lot of gamesmanship. These guys are just going to surf it out. Here's Mitch Cruz and too deep, too far up the point. And a shame for Mitch Cruz because now the clock's going to tick down. And he's going to go to the back of the line. Toy Meister, another beautiful waves and continues with that long arc surfing that we've seen from him. Snaps it up. But that time, the nose pearls. Waves, but they're not really user-friendly for moves. Uh, you get that real tight transition, and it's tough to keep your surfboard flowing through it. Watch this surfboard. It's going to get stuck right there. So you see your, your surfboard only has so much rocker. Uh, and, you know, so to fit it in that transition is tough. You really have to be quick with your reflexes and stomp on the tail. So watch the nose of his board. It's going to poke right there. He would yell during his turns. That's right, like a, cool. like a kung fu artist, right? He would go, hi -ya! Audio off the lip. Here's our heat leader, Tori Meister. He's just looking for a ride in at this point. And he goes to the prone position, and he's going to call it a heat. Knowing that he advanced on, we're going to see Jadson on to the finals day at the Vans World Cup for surfing. Nat Young and Mitch Cruz out of competition. And local boy, Tori Meister, taking out a big win.